There's a new kid on the block, and could it spell problems for Nice Ash and the other profit switching miners? Let's find out. So in today's video, I'm going to go through the Project Gamer Hash, do a full review and show you guys exactly what it's about. Also, this is the answer to win video for my weekly free Bitcoin giveaway, Bitcoin Friday. So stay tuned for details on how you can enter this week's contest. If this is your first time here, welcome to the channel. My name is Shane. Make sure you subscribe, click that notification bell and set all notifications. And if you like this kind of content, make sure you smash that like button. Turn it blue, helps this video out and the channel in the YouTube algorithm. I greatly appreciate it. Let's get into it. All right, so as usual in every video, everything I'm talking about will be down below so you guys don't have to search for any of this information. So here we are on GamerHash.com. Share computing power and earn. It's simple, it's convenient, it's for everybody. A gateway for non-technical users to reap the rewards offered by blockchain. So basically, this is something like a nice hash, Kudo Miner, Better Hash, Cryptex, something like that. Basically, does the same thing. Finds the most profitable coin to mine and converts it to Bitcoin for you. And here's how it works. Install Gamer Hash, mine with your idle power, a complete task. That's a new little thing that the other profit switching miners do not have. And then, of course, you can use it through holding it in your wallet, paying grocery stores, which is going to be in the future, and spend in their marketplace. And we go down and GamerCoin has got about 880 million coins or GHX is their little ticker signal. It's got a token sale of 322 million. I don't know how I feel about that personally, but hey, it's neither here nor there right now. Got a hard cap of 2.8 million and a soft cap of 1,150,000. We are creating GamerCoin native token for gamers. GamerCoin is a token for GamerHash platform. It's the last puzzle of the gaming ecosystem and fuel which makes 550,000 users life easier. I don't know how accurate that is, 500. I think it's actually 560,000, they say. But they claim that there's that many users on here. That I can't verify, but it's neither here nor there right now as well. Gamers will have many ways to earn GXX through mining and entertainment on the platform. Keeping tokens in a wallet will bring many benefits and spending GHX in the marketplace will open special offers. It's a game changer for the gaming generation. And if you go ahead and click on GamerCoin, it'll bring you over here and just give you some more info on the actual GamerCoin itself. It does have a couple of awards here. The most recent best startup winner granted by Miami Blockchain Week 2020. So this has been around for a while since back in 2019. It looks like it started. So maybe going on a full two years coming up. And if you scroll down here, I just want to show you here market potential. GamerHash connects two rapidly growing technologies into one unique business concept. Gamers meet blockchain in their own environment and spread adoption of new economy models. I know here, at least in the past, gamers do not like us miners, but this looks like they're trying to bridge the gap and help these actual gamers make some money and show them how blockchain can actually benefit them by using their graphics cards when they're not using them for gaming. All right, so that's enough about this project. We're gonna go ahead and hop over to my NVIDIA rig and I'll show you guys how GamerHash actually works. All right, so here it is up and running on the NVIDIA rig. Again, if you guys are interested in downloading this, Stay tuned for details on how you can get 50 additional entries into my contest just by clicking on a link and go ahead and check this project out. It's a really easy install, kind of like a nice hash type install. And once you go through it and get it set up and ready to go, enter username, stuff like that, you'll be up and mining in no time. All right, so this is the dashboard, exactly what it's going to look like. And here's my username and make sure you put your device name in there. I put mine in video rig, you can put it whatever you want, totally up to you. So let me go ahead and click stop right here. And the first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is go over to benchmark. I think it does it automatically in light mode, but you're gonna to wanna to go ahead and make sure you do it in full mode to get the most benefit out of your graphics card. That usually is not going to take any more than five to 10 minutes, at least it took me that long. Not too big of a deal. I got four cards on this rig, 1070 Ti, 1060 and 21660 Ti's. So once you do that full benchmark, just go ahead and click back. And there's another thing you're going to want to go ahead and make sure that's set that I didn't do originally in the first 24 hours. You go over to mining and you're going to want to make sure this little operation mode right here, I get on a higher earnings. It's going to start out on comfort 
and you're not going to make as much. So if you're just going to be using this for mining, make sure you click on higher earnings. If you're going to be doing dual like gaming and mining, go ahead and click on comfort. Again, that's going to be totally up to you. I'm using my CPU in here as well. I only got six cores, so I'm using four of them right now. Otherwise, it'll get pretty laggy. So if you go over to advanced, I've got this checked right now. Choose the best option. Of course, it's a profit switching miner. So I left that checked. Again, if you guys want to go ahead and select your own miner, you just deselect that and you can choose whatever miner you want to use and you should be good to go. So again, I'm going to leave mine checked because I want to in full true profit switching mode. And also this is deselected when you go in here. I went ahead and selected it. I like to see my miner up and mining just to make sure everything is going all right. So once you're done there, just go ahead and click save and it'll go back to the beginning right here. And all you gotta do is click start at this point and a miner will be up and starting. And if you go down here in the console window and you can see it's using G miner and mining Ethereum and it's gonna be mining Monero of course on the CPU. So now you can go ahead and head over to the dashboard. This is my dashboard right here. I've been using this for maybe 36 hours right now, not too long. And I'm up almost at about $5. Of course, like I said, the first 24 hours, I was in that little comfort mode and not in the full miner mode. So we'll see what the next 24 hour brings. I'm definitely gonna be using this in my next miner cup. Details on that here in a second. So as you can see here, there's my Nvidia rig. And you can go ahead and click on all if you got multiple rigs. And of course, it'll show you everything that's going on right now. And this is today's earnings. You got yesterday's, the last seven days, et cetera, et cetera. And down here, it'll give you some rough estimates of what you can expect to make. Of course, I don't know how accurate those are. Usually not too accurate, at least as far as different miners that I've come across. You can go ahead and click on wallet. And this will show you your Bitcoin wallet, which is going to be right here. And it'll show you your pending balance and, of course, what you have available. One thing I did like, it only takes 0.01 MBTC to go ahead and withdraw. So you don't need to have a lot in there to pull your earnings out. Also, you get bonuses for mining here as well. You get, as you can see right here, I got 6.64 gamer coin. They're claiming it's 33 cents. It's not on any exchanges right now, so I don't know where they're getting that actual figure from. But you do get little bonuses in gamer coin. That's kind of like honey miners bonus, but you're actually getting the gamer coin instead. So you get those daily, I'm assuming. See how that goes over the next 24 hours as well. We can head over to coin market cap and it does have gamer coin listed but of course there's no data on it at the moment but maybe that will go ahead and change here in the future when it gets on some exchanges so we can head back over to the platform click on history and this just shows you a history of you know withdrawals stuff like that how much you've made etc etc so that is a brief overview of GamerHash. let me know what you guys think down below you guys interested in using this have you ever heard of it I'm interested in your guys' feedback as usual. Let me know down below. So like I stated earlier, I got a new Miner Cup series coming up. I'm actually going to be doing it legit now. I got two 1660 Ti's. I'm going to pull that off my NVIDIA rig. And I'm going to create two separate identical rigs using the 1660 Ti's. And it's probably going to be at least another couple of weeks out before they do that. And then, of course, I'll add Gamer Hash to my next Miner Cup, which I think is going to be Miner Cup number five. All right, so now let's head over to my website and I'll show you guys how to enter this week's Bitcoin Fridays. All right, so here we are in thecryptofish.com. As it is every time, make sure you enter your email address right there. Click subscribe. This is just in case YouTube doesn't notify you guys of my Enter to Win videos. I send you an email, lets you know the latest video is out. You can come over, watch the video, and enter that week's contest. So Bitcoin Fridays, free Bitcoin giveaway, 3-12-2021. As it is every week, two winners, $20 in Bitcoin each. And all you have to do to go ahead and enter is answer one question correctly. What was this video about? Once you enter that, you're going to have to enter your name, email address. You're going to have to verify that email address. It will bring you back here where you can get additional entries into the contest by following me on various social media. Also, there'll be a link there to go ahead and check out GamerHash. All you gotta do is click on that link. You'll get 50 additional entries into the contest. That's really a no brainer right there. So that's as easy as it is to enter my weekly free Bitcoin giveaways. Again, if you're new here or this is your first time, consider subscribing. 
clicking that notification bell and setting all notifications. If you like this kind of content, make sure you smash that like button, turn it blue, helps this video and the channel in the YouTube algorithm. I would greatly appreciate that. All right, I will see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching. Take care and bye.